Hello everybody, in this video we will check out the new updates in the command Stream and Extend that came first time in the version AutoCAD 2021. Let's see what they are. I'm going to start with Stream. If you are familiar with this command, up to the version 2020 we needed to pick up the cutting edges first, then press Enter and finally we could trim the segments up to the point they meet one of the selected objects. Now, in AutoCAD 2021, Autodesk made this tool easier. And I think for students that are new with AutoCAD, it's way more intuitive. Basically, now we skip the first step and instead we can erase directly any segment of line or curve between one or two intersections. Here, in this small exercise, I need to get rid of these segments below, which I can either click directly on them or draw a selection path to erase objects quicker. Another update is that now we can delete entire lines that before it was not possible. It was required to exit a command, select the line and press delete. Now, we can still use the older method, as in some situations can be a bit faster to use. For example, in this section above, I'm going to select the option Cutting Edges here on the command bar, select these four lines, press Enter and now I can erase the sections, taking only in consideration the selected objects. That's the reason now everything is erased from the left of this vertical line. The command extend got a similar update. In this case, in the other versions, we had to select this time the boundary edges first and then the lines to extend. So, after switching on the command, we only need to specify the lines right away, it can be with this fence, to make this to work. So, it's very simple as you can see. And also remember to click closer to the section that we want to extend. On the right side of this example, our goal is to extend to a line that is located beyond the closest one. Like for the command trim, we have to select one of the options, this time is the boundary edges, to use the older method. I'm going to pick these two lines as our boundary, press enter, and now I can extend the lines to the ones that I have selected. Okay, it looks like we reached the end of this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you haven't done it yet, subscribe to Cadding Black. There you can find all the content of tutorials for beginners. See you on the next occasion.